let's look at our lesson, Subtraction, with pictures up to 10. They ask us to subtract. We're given a group and then another group. So this has one, two, so it's two minus or take away one is equal to something. So let's write that as a problem. We have one, two, and we're going to take away or subtract one of them and see what that is equal to. So if we have two, one, two, and we take away one of those, how many do we have left? Yes, just one. So our answer is one. All right, now I see we have three dolls. One, two, three and they want us to subtract or take away one. So if we know that we have three and we want to take away one, let's see how many that will be. If we have one, two, three, and we take away one of those, how many do we have left? Yes, two. All right, here I see that we have one, two clovers and they want us to take away one, so it would be two minus one is equal to a number. So if we have two and we take one of those away, how many are left? Yep, just one. So one is our final answer. Ooh, now we have one, two, three, we are taking away just one. Let's see how many that would be. We have one, two, three. We're taking away one of them. How many do we have left? I see one, two. So our final answer is two. All right, here we have one, two, and they want us to take away one of them. Let's see how much that is equal to. If we have two, and we take away one. There's just one left. Fantastic. All right, now let's see what this one says. One, two, three, four oranges. Minus or take away one, two, three. What is that equal to? Let's draw a picture. One, two, three, four oranges, and we're gonna take away three. One, two, three. Great, we have one left. So our answer is one. Do you see a one down here? Yes, right here. All right, time to subtract. One, two, three, four, five. Take away one. So I know that this sign means I'm going to take away, so I'm going to draw five and take away one of them. One, two, three, four, five. And I'll take away one. Let's see how many that is. One, two, three, four. Ah, because four is just one less than five. It is the number that comes right before five. So we know that five minus one is four. Great. All right, next we have one, two, minus one. Let's see what that is equal to. If we have two and we take away one of them, how many are we left with? Yes, just one. All right, now I see we have one, two, three, and they want us to take away one, two of those. Let's see what that is equal to. Let's draw our own. One, two, three. And we're gonna take away two of them. How many are we left with? Yep, just one. Okay, here's our last problem. We have one, two, three, four, five basketballs, and they want us to take away one of them. Do you remember what we can do when we're taking away one? We can count back 
just one number. So if we're counting down, we'd go five, four, oh, so our answer is four. But let's double check with the picture. One, two, three, four, five. And then we take one of these away, so it's like we're counting back. One, two, three, four. Yes, the answer is four. Do you see it down below? Me too, it's right here. You did such a great job today.